Hello and welcome back to another Microsoft Flight Simulator video. We are on approach into Oakland in the beautiful, newly updated Embraer E-170 from Flight Sim Studio. Now, I will be very honest with you. I... So I, I attempted to record a video, a departure video. Uh, departed from LA in this plane and on this route right now but there were some complications first off I had problems with say intentions there seemed to be major delays so they must have had server issues going on next was issues with FS traffic planes just were not stopping they were going through my plane which typically they do do stop and thirdly this beautiful e-jet was having issues with the speed now in this update they have a brand new fms um, but i was having issues with it just over speeding so from my what i read if you switch it to manual so if you go over here to the little guy you know, knob so it's on manual now if you just switch it from it's normally on fms if you switch it over to manual then you can program your speed like you normally would in the past. A tip though that I read in the Discord, which definitely does work, is if you are on FMS and you want to switch to manual, I would they would recommend you turn off the auto throttle first, switch to manual, put that dial in the speed you want, and then switch the auto throttle back on. Because else it's gonna keep the current auto throttle that is set in the system. Or this the speed that's set in the system. So with all those technical issues. I decided to scrap that plan of uploading that video and we're just gonna do the approach video here so like I said we're on approach into Oakland we're expecting runway 30 uh, we're about 34 nautical miles east southeast of the airport and it should be pretty simple approach here uh, we're a little higher than we're supposed to be at this point we're supposed to be at about 8,000 feet so slightly higher than than what we're supposed to um, say intentions doesn't quite know the altitudes restrictions though when you fly with say intentions right now and you're, you're going on, a, on an approach what I would recommend is just kind of setting your altitudes for what you believe are correct compared to the navigraph you know if you're using that or I should say the charts that's mostly what I try to do. This way you get down to where you're supposed to get down to um, instead of time uh, say intentions will have you fly too high. Sky okay. West 510, descend and maintain 8,000. 8,000. 8,000 Sky West 510. Alright, so we're at that beautiful uh, between 9 and uh, 10,000 so I turn the lights on. This is a Let's Life Chapter 2 flight as I normally do. Funny thing I, is, I, I attempted to do a. And I attempted to do a uh, A320 flight with uh, a pilot like Chapter 2 yesterday and actually do a couple videos. Uh, but, say intentions. Or, sorry, not say intentions. Uh, I forgot. I had the plane already in turnaround mode, the en or, uh, taxi mode for the panel state, so the engines were on. I forgot that with. Pilot side, you have to have the engines off to actually begin the flight. And I didn't realize that until halfway through the flight. And I was like, well, too bad for that. So I'm not going to go back and redo the flight. <laughs> and it was one of the longer flights. Uh, and I'm not a, uh, one, I'm not a big fan of doing long flights already. Uh, and two, I just, I don't know, there's something about the A320 that I, I've lost interest in once. I've said this in a couple other videos, but. Uh, the CRJ and the 737 came out. I just lost the interest in the A320. I don't think I'm an Airbus guy. I do love the A300. It's a fun plane. Really big and heavy. But for some reason, the A320, I just don't have a whole lot of interest in. Okay, so we should be capturing our localizer soon. I'm waiting for the radios to swap. Doesn't look like they are. They haven't so far, at least. this. 
not sure what that button means. Is that telling me to do something? Uh, let's see. Performance approach speed. Is that what it said? Descent speed? Uh, 280 on descent. Well, we're not going to be using that. Landing V reps are already in there. Sky West 510, contact NorCal approach on 135.1. Okay, so nothing really special there. Uh, 1351. 1, 5 and a 1. NorCal approach. Good morning, Sky West 510. We're at, uh, 4,800 descending 2,700. We're actually going a little too fast now, so let's uh, pull this back a little bit. And then we're also bringing back our speed. Sky West 510, NorCal approach. Good evening. Livermore altimeter 3003. 3003. Okay. And this has not switched over yet, so I'm going to go ahead and manually pop it in. I'm not sure why that has it. I can just hit this button, dummy. There we go. Okay, so now we should have... Yep, there it is. And that's all looking good. should now be able to do the following. We're going to do heading select, heading mode. I'm going to switch over to this guy. Our approach 298. Hit this button. 296. Sorry, 296. Okay, and then we're going to do... Uh, where's that here? Approach. Okay, localizer's been captured. Happened to the thing. Sky West 510 NorCal approach. Alrighty, you'll want to contact Oakland Tower. Just switch over to 118.3 when you can. 296. Okay. Alright, looking good. Contact Tower 1183. Okay, we're on Tower. Oakland Tower, good morning. Sky was 510 on final 30. Alright, flaps level 1 down. Skywest 510, Oakland Tower, turn left heading 190 vectors for the ILS runway 30 approach. Yeah, something's all goofed up with that. Sky West 510, Oakland Tower, turn left, heading 175. Let's try to have this vector back around for some Sky reason. Sky West 510, Oakland Tower, less <laughs> than one mile from Wuvon. Turn left, heading 295 until established on the localizer. Cleared for the ILS runway 30 approach. We're just going to chill here. I'm not going to say anything because I might goof it all up. So We should get clearance to land here momentarily. Hopefully. Gear coming down. So I was reading there is a button over here somewhere for headphone mode. Oh, that button. That's cool. Every plane should have that. Every plane. Sky West 510, Oakland Tower, winds 324 at Niner. Runway 30 clear to land. Runway 30, clear to land. Sky West 510. Okay. All's looking good. One thing that was interesting 
is that the plane didn't go all crazy like it normally does. I don't know if I intercepted it at the right time. Typically the E-Jet, once on approach, or once it's uh, vectoring to the localizer, it just goes all crazy. So that's pretty cool that it did not this time. Maybe that's been somewhat fixed. One thousand call should be any second now. I don't know if this plane has a thousand call actually. Now that I think about it. Diamond three seven one Bravo Charlie, make a three six zero degree turn to the right. off my aircraft. Making a three six zero degree right turn. Diamond three seven one Bravo Charlie. Exit to the right. Because we don't want to go into the ocean on the left. Rooney 824 Foxtrot Delta, enter right base runway 27. Oh, got a big old right stutter. Runway 27 for Mooney 824 Foxtrot Delta. Nice calm final. day with the wind. Very nice. Right downwind, runway 15 will report. Three mile final, Mooney 824, Foxtrot Delta. 500. Piper Hotel Alpha Kilo winds 129 are at 16, runway 16 center cleared for takeoff. Smooth landing. All right. Very nice, very nice. Flaps coming up. Exit off the runway. Landing lights off. We don't need taxi lights in the daytime. For your safety. Please remain seated and keep your And we should get our ground switch. Please leave. All mm. carry on items stowed. Seeing it switch to X. The uh, transponder code off. again. Before leaving, please be sure you have all your belongings. That's no good. Be careful before opening the overhead bins because baggage may have moved and could fall out. Thank you for flying with us. I actually did that we when I started the flight. On Sky West 510, welcome to Oakland. Contact ground on 121.75. Two one seven five. Oakland ground. Good morning, Skywest five one zero. Taxiing to parking. Normally I say what taxi we am on, but I failed to look. I'm on Wilco. Let's see. So maybe it'll be unicorn uniform. Wilco to uniform, or will be pack taxi at your discretion. One of the two. Yeah. 510 Oakland ground taxi to parking at your discretion. Good morning. Well, I think it's the the Egypt performed fairly well. Uh, the speed is the only issue I had. Uh, whatever is going on with the auto speed, I think they need to get a hot patch out or something. Because that should not be an issue for the next month while they're waiting for the next patch to come out. Uh, St. Tension did a pretty good job. A little goof up there on the. Uh, on the uh, final but overall it's pretty decent uh, very good flight so if you have this e-jet let me know in your comments down below or in the comments down below what your thoughts are of the new update if you installed it and have done a flight and uh, if you have same intentions or if you're interested in same intentions give me a comment down below what your thoughts on that as well we'll see you for the next video take care